today we're going to change the fuel tank on a Briggs & Stratton 90 502 engine in a M40 450C McCulloch lawnmower. Before you remove the fuel tank we advise you to watch our how to drain your fuel tank video for the Briggs & Stratton 90 502 engine. First, remove the screws with an imperial quarter inch socket spanner that holds the cover in place. Then you will have to remove the air filter which sits on top of the carburetor with a screwdriver. When the air filter cover has been removed you can access the carburetor. To remove the carburetor you will now need to free the fuel tank. To do this, you need to unscrew the screws that secure the flywheel guard and then the remaining screws on the side, holding the control bracket using a half inch 13mm socket spanner. You will also need to remove the smaller screw on the control bracket located on the side. Now, to release the screw on the top governor blade, use a quarter inch socket spanner. The tank should be entirely freed. You can now remove the screws with the posi drive number 2 to remove the carburetor from the tank. Clear and wipe any spillages or flammable liquids. Make sure the carburetor, tank and connector is clean before placing back by using maintenance spray. Put the new carburetor into place and secure it with the screws. For a tip, be careful not to over tighten as the tank is made from aluminium. Now the tank and carburetor are now connected, join the tank back onto the connector. Make sure you place the guard behind the tank and align it where the screw goes through, then secure the screw. Place the bracket and the blade back, then fasten them with the screws. Connect the tank with the screws on either side. Place the air filter case back over the top of the carburetor and tighten with the screw. Finally, place the cover back over the top, fixing with the screws provided. Let's say you change the fuel tank on a Briggs & Stratton 90 502 engine. All the parts and tools needed for this task are listed in the description below. Please like, share and subscribe if you found this video helpful.